All right, everybody. I just got in from one of my partners, the new Hue. Well, not new. It's been out for about a year. Um, I've been wanting to get one. We have a lot of partners here at Mac Media Studios, uh, PimpYourIPhone.com. And we got a lot of people that want to send us stuff, get reviews. You know, since we are a celebrity endorsed and backed company, um, everybody's trying to get us stuff. And it's kind of cool, but it, you know, you would think to yourself, oh, wow, you get all this free cool stuff. And, you know, it it is cool, but it's not. It's sometimes it's cool, sometimes it's not because you got to do the reviews. And then you got to edit, you know, doing one review just to let you guys know, you know, it takes like four or five hours, you know, just doing this small part of it, we've got to edit it, we've got to set it all up, we've got to show how it works, you know, so that everybody will know how cool it is. So I just got the box, here's the front of it, um, it does open up, this is how you open it. I was trying to figure out, so you pick up from the side here. And when you pick the little little color wheel thing here, it'll open up. I'm trying to do this while it's sitting up on my desk here. And there is, this is the whole thing. It shows you how it works. It's got like little things of like, you know, meet the hue, blah, blah, blah. You know, uh, how to plug it in. And then you've got your code there. It's got a little light bulb in the middle. Kind of cool. QC code. Then we got the bulbs, and they're all inside the base here. You've got a wireless chip. You've got a color um, wheel that changes the colors of the bulbs because all the bulbs are the same. So each bulb is just a bulb, but all the electronics is in the base here. And they are a little bit heavy because there is a lot of stuff in this space here. And then the LED is here. It's a gigantic LED. Now, these are equivalent to a 60 watt bulb. So, if you guys, you know, are used to having 100 watt bulbs or, you know, any of the other, other type of incandescent lamps, you know, like the one that's up inside here. I don't know if you can actually see it. If I can actually show you. Yeah, there's the one that I use on my little lamp over here. So, that one's 40 watts. And it's putting out, I mean, when I flip it up, it lights up the whole room at 40 watts. This. Is equivalent the bulbs at full brightness they equivalent to 60 watt bulbs so you can slide up and down the colors you can slide up and down the intensity um, when they're plugged in uh, this plugs into you know your route router um, and it gets a signal and it knows exactly how many bulbs are attached and you you just um, attach them it goes through Wi-Fi it finds it this is the base station for the bulbs and then you use your app on your iPhone or iPad, whatever you got. You know, I'll be showing you guys all that after I get all set up. You know, I do have the Nest that I got installed. I got that for my partner too. Uh, we got the Nest installed. Uh, it is working great. Um, right here on one of my old, uh, well, one of my iPhones, iPhone 4s's. Um, this is the actual Nest app. I have the brightness turned all the way down, so. I can I, I can always see what the dial reads over there out there uh, on the outside of my door. Um, I can actually see what is going on on the outside. I'll show all that to you later also. But you know if I turn the button now, it'll turn it to blue because it'll turn on. I'll just show you that right now. Just hit the button down. Now it's 69, and the room temperature is 70. So now it just turned blue because it just turned on and you guys can't hear it, but my air conditioner just came on. So it's going to be, it's going to take 25 minutes because it's 71 degrees in here. It's going to take 25 minutes to get it down to 69 degrees. So that's, that's one of the really, really cool things I love about Nest. Uh, also, Nest is the most accurate thermostat on the market right now. There is no better thermostat on the market. Um, I had a 15-year-old digital one up there, and you know it would say it was uh, 68, but it was actually like 70. So for me to get 68, I had to put it on like 66, because it was really funny. Because right now at 69, it's freezing in here, 
when around this time with the other one I would have to have it down at 66 or 67 or so to get it to be like 70 so if you actually go to nest.com and you read about the actual um, uh, there is a the energy savings part of it there's a page right there that tells you because there is a die well well I'll, I'll do like a little thing on that I don't want to get too much into that but it is really really cool it tells you how long um, how much energy that it used that day um, how what times it came on at what time it does so much stuff so this is the front of the box you know you see the front of the box everything's inside there and then um, when you flip it around this kind of shows you what it, it's able to do you got different colors the bulbs are all the same you can just change them from different you know different colors and you got your iPhone and it does so many different things with the iPhone and I'm about to set it up um, so that's it so I'll get back, yeah, I'll get back with you guys in a few after I get everything set up kind of show you how I got stuff set up on my own there is quite a few apps in the app store that help play with this thing turn it into like a strobe and disco and there's all sorts of things I want to use it for my theater in my living room I have a 65 inch uh, plasma uh, Mitsubishi I spent a lot of money on and um, it uh, I want one of the good things about it, I'd be able to dim it and have like a very low dim in there instead of just being black. And our kitchen is right around the corner, so the light from the kitchen always goes in there. And that's how I'm able to get the kitchen done. So, but I'll come back and show you guys how it works and after I get it all installed, everything. I'll come right back.